Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am Denise of My Luxury First, and today I am going to show you the difference between 0.5 grams per strand and 1 gram per strand. So both of these are the micro loop ring hair extensions. They already have the bead and the loop already attached for you, so that way you don't have to buy extra accessories. But these are 0.5 grams per strand and these are one gram per strand. And you can see the difference. Noticeably, these hair extensions strands are thicker than these. It's one gram, 0 0.5 gram. So for example, if you get a pack of 100 strands that are all one gram per strand, then you already have 100 grams of hair. So you probably only need one more pack and you might have a full head already. But with the 0 0.5 grams per strand, you will need at least four packs to equal the same 100 grams here. Because these are 0 0.5 grams per strand, you would need two packs of 100, which would be 200 strands, in order to get but to 100 with this one, the thicker ones, which are the brown ones, you only need two packs and you're already at 200 grams. So that's the difference when choosing if you want to get a 0 0.5 gram per strand or a 1 gram per strand. And there's also 0 0.6 grams and 0 0.8 grams, but um, usually people always get the 0 0.5 grams, which is probably cheaper and easier. And then um, if you have a little bit more money to spend or you just want thicker hair and you just don't want to just have all these extra strands in your head, you can go for the one gram per strand and just knock it out already. So you see the beads here. These are the micro beads that are attached to the hair. And these are the little ones with the screw line inside. So that way they when attach you slip the hair. your hair through, you can just clamp it and it'll already be on there. And then these are the same thing, except as you can see, the beads are a little bit bigger and they're also um, like they have like a silicone or um, just some type of lining inside, lining. which actually is the silicone. So this is like a different protection. So, for example, some people, their hair is more prone to breakage. So you would want to use the silicone beads because they have the lining in there. So that way, when you clamp the hair, you know, it's not just rubbing right against the bead. So depending on how your hair is, also if you have very oily hair, if it's not clamped tight enough, it, these can slip out. And then for these, which are the screw lined ones, um, they're more sturdier. And when you clamp them onto your hair, you can just, you'll know that they're going to just stay there um, until your hair grows out. But again, if you have oily hair, then they can slip out, but they're not as easy to slip out as the ones with the silicone lining on them because these have like a screw texture inside. So when you clamp them, you know that they're going to be there. And then these have the silicone lining inside. So when you clamp them, I mean, they're going to be there but they're just a little bit more easier on the hair. So you can expect a little bit of slippage if you're not careful and or if your hair is very oily. So um, also these are the brown or the dark chocolate brown hair extension strands and then these are like the burgundy red. So just giving you a little background and just a little knowledge or information. And if you have any more questions, go ahead and leave a comment or thumbs up the video as well if this helped you and um, also open the bar below so you can get more information and like and subscribe. Thank you for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye. And why luxury is no for hair undoubtedly. We're talking yeah. about extensions running out Rapunzel's balcony. So check it out and clip it in or